Hello guys, in this tutorial we will see how to increase your Wi-Fi speed on Windows 10 or Windows 11 PC. The first thing is to go to Control Panel. Then this Control Panel setting, click on Network and Internet. In this page, click on Network and Sharing Center. After navigating in this page, click on Change adapter settings. As you can see, a list of your uh, Bluetooth, Ethernet, and Wi Fi access page is opened. Here is what we have wanted. Uh, if you are comfortable with command line, you can open this page with a command. To open with a command, right click on the start and click on run and type ncpa. Dot CPL. And this command also opens this the same thing. And right click on the Wi Fi and click on properties. In this properties page, click on Internet Protocol version 4 and click on properties again. As you can see, my DNS is assigned automatically. So we will change this to a default or other DNS addresses. In this DNS address, we can use one, 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 and one, zero, zero, what as a DNS server. This is a cloud DNS server, and you can type OK and you can use this DNS server. In case if this DNS server didn't work for you, you can use a Google DNS server, which is 8888, then at the bottom, 8844. You can use this alternative DNS. The first one is a cloud DNS server, and the second one is Google DNS server. This is the first step. We have finished the first step. The first and the main step is finished. Uh, this is how you will increase your um, Wi Fi speed using Google Small Cloud DNS servers. Okay, guys, the second thing you have to do to increase your Wi Fi speed on PC is uh, again go to properties, right click and go to properties, click on configure. This page, go to Advanced and click on channel width for 2.4 gigahertz. Make sure it's auto, and also the 5 gigahertz also should be this value should be auto. And the fat channel intolerant must be disabled. Make sure it's disabled, and also the preferred band should be. Uh, prefer 5 gigahertz band. You should select the, the third one because 5 gigahertz is the best one. And the roaming aggressiveness should be the lowest because most of the time we use uh, nearby to the, our Wi Fi, so the lowest roaming aggressiveness is better. If you are uh, more than 20 meters away from your Wi Fi, you should select the medium or medium high. But my Wi Fi is almost three meters away from my laptop, so I choose the lowest. And here you are finished. We are finished getting your Wi Fi speed. So let me know in the comments if this has worked for you. For sure, this will work for you. For me, as in release the speed of the Wi Fi almost 700%. So Make sure to use it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.